As one of the beneficiaries of this year's Priority Toyota Charity Bowl, I spoke with their executive director about all of the services they offer, starting with what they are doing to get food to people who need it. We have a food pantry. Uh, we have a food box programs for families with children under the age of 18. And then we also have our community dinner, which is our longest tenure program. Um, that's when we serve a dinner every day of the year uh, for anybody who is in need. And then in our housing programs, we have an emergency shelter. We have a transitional housing program for homeless veterans, permanent supportive ho housing program for homeless individuals with disabilities. And then we do a day support program, which is almost kind of entryway uh, for people who are homeless can come in, take a shower, uh, do laundry, computer services, housing services, get linked uh, to mainstream resources or community resources to address any other issues they may be dealing with. And so with everything that you all do, how important is it to get this support from the Charity Bowl and, and how will that help you guys continue your mission? One of the things I love about the Charity Bowl and, and Priority is um, it, they really have taken the time to educate themselves on all the social issues that are occurring in our community especially with the nonprofits and, and different organizations that they support. So that's important because especially when it comes to homelessness and hunger, those are unique situations. Those are not like simple issues with simple solutions. They're very complex. And so that money, because it's unrestricted and we can use it wherever needed, it allows us to really extend and be able to do a variety of different things and be creative and innovative in how we use the money to make sure that we help the people that, that are in need. So their big 35th anniversary gala is coming up next month. You can learn about that and the other beneficiaries of this year's Charity Bowl right now on WTKR.com.